Happy Thanksgiving everybody! I just wanted to do a quick video this morning before I cleaned off my table to get everything going showing you how to take a pattern that's on your machine and get it onto your computer so that you can use it in Inkscape or in any of your other programs, okay? So this is the, the main screen when your thing comes up it's gonna you know have the little pretty screen with the butterfly and stuff like that. You hit your home screen, it's gonna give you pattern or scan. We're going to choose pattern and there's Sissy right there. So excited getting ready to go out, but she might whine a little, so I apologize. <laughs> okay, so let's just grab any of these things. I'm gonna go in here, I'm gonna click on this, and let's say we want this specific snowflake. I just have a crush on these snowflakes this year for some reason, so. Okay, and we're gonna click set, and it's gonna bring it up onto the canvas onto our machine. See, this is our little, it's basically a representation of our map. Of our mat, I mean, not our mat. Okay, so we're gonna do that and then we're gonna go to save. And instead of saving it to your machine, you can save it to USB. This is the USB connected to your computer. So right now, I have my cord in. Oh, it starts over here. Let's see, can we? There we go. Oh. So that's what my cord looks like. It's the cord from my brother embroidery machine. And it's hooked into my laptop on the side. Okay. And then we're gonna take that cute little snowflake and we're gonna push this button right there. And it's gonna say save to USB media, file name 0007, click okay. All right. So then when you come over to your computer, your folder for the removable disc, and I'm really sorry for all the graininess just happens, okay? This should say your removable disc or whatever you have it labeled as, and see how I have U0007.fcm? That is the snowflake. 006 is the wreath that I did just trying this out at first, okay? And then the other one was something I was cutting this morning. But it's just that simple, and then you can take that and save it to your desktop or wherever you want to save it and then you can use it to create other files um, and mix and merge them and stuff like that if you know how to do that. Alrighty, thanks guys, bye!